This morning, violent crimes, including killings, are on the rise, and the area we're talking about is Maryville. Investigators highlighting four homicides in particular. ABC 15's Melissa Blasey has just talked to detectives. Melissa, what are they telling you? Well, first of all, they say they're adding extra officers to patrol this area. They also say they need the public's help. This crossover here marks where the latest killing happened over the weekend. The youngest of the three shooting victims was a 12-year-old girl. Her family says she was shot in the neck and died. They were gunned down while listening to music in a car in their own driveway at night. Officers with silent witness flyers are walking this block and dozens of other blocks in this neighborhood. They're looking for the public's help to solve four murders in this area. They all happened in the last two months or so. And while there are similarities in these cases, they don't know if any of them are linked. What investigators do know is this. There is no apparent motive for any of these four cases. Police are asking everyone who lives in this area near 63rd Avenue, especially between McDowell and Thomas, to be aware of what's happening around them. And they are offering a reward for information information in these cases coming up tonight at 5 p.m. We will have much more specifics about these four murder cases as well as talking to the grandfather of that little 12-year-old girl. Back to you. We have 